welcome to JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Jamie Scott Okataya on the floor here today at Telecom Exchange NYC. Joining me here is a good dear friend of mine, Mr. Cliff Kane. He is the co-CEO of Clarion Fiber Networks. Cliff, welcome to Telecom Exchange. Thank you for having us, Jamie. Pleasure to be here. It's a pleasure to have you. And for our viewers who may not already know, hopefully they do, but can you give us a couple of uh, key points of, of who Clarion is? Sure, happy to. Clarion is a dark fiber provider uh, that operates out of New York City. We are a franchisee with the city, so we are building uh, fiber networks throughout uh, New York. Uh, we are looking to promote the, uh, the net carrier neutral access model, again, bring that back to the marketplace. And uh, we are very excited to, about our business and going forward. And talking carrier neutral uh, model, you have recently announced that you expanded your network into Digital Realty Telex's trifecta, NYC trifecta. Can you tell us what that means for Clarion and Telex customers? Oh, this is a really a great thing. Uh, Telex uh, has several hundred service providers and uh, cloud companies and financial market services companies that are their customers. And by attaching our network or bringing our network in and installing POPs at Telex in the, in the three sites in New York City, we can then bring those uh, customers out to their customers, we can facilitate peering, we can facilitate buying and selling between these companies. It's, it's a very exciting, uh, very uh, customer dense environment and we're very happy that uh, we're in Telex. And today here at Telecom Exchange is a lot of buzz going on about the need for dark fiber in and around New York. Tell us what is Clarion's key differentiators there? Well, as far as uh, differentiators, we like to be a very open an easy uh, company to deal with. A lot of uh, dark fiber providers um, say that they provide dark fiber, but there's restrictions on it. We sell our fiber without restriction. Uh, we tr we're trying to bring some clarity and, and transparency to a very opaque market. Uh, so we're very open about you know, showing customers routes, test results, and uh, just generally uh, you know, trying to uh, be a solution for the customer and help them uh, uh, figure out what their network needs uh, have the best answer their network needs. Definitely customer focused is a hallmark of Clarion for sure. So I love when I have a CEO next to me because I, I like to throw this question out. Peering into your crystal ball, I know you have one in your back pocket, yep. uh, but what do you see for Clarion in the next six to 12 months? So six to 12 months, we're gonna to continue to uh, build our network, continue to bring customers on board. Uh, it, the, uh, that's really a kind of a short-term uh, view for us. Uh, that's in New York City, but going beyond that, I'm sure you want to hear about beyond that. I yeah. think you know, really, what we, we're trying to do here is provide an infrastructure that facilitates almost any kind of uh, interactivity between service providers and customers. A neutral uh, uh, infrastructure that uh, can help businesses grow uh, by being very uh, efficient and effective at delivering services. So. Absolutely, a lot of good news heading uh, heading our way from Clarion. Thank you, Cliff, for joining us. Thank you, Jamie. And, and thank you, viewers, for tuning in to JSA TV.